Hey guys, what is up? So today I'm going to be doing a dorm tour video. I've been really looking forward to filming this and I was super excited to make it. So yeah, let's get on into the video. Alrighty, so I am a first year student at UC Davis and I've been living in the Tresero Residence Hall area this year, specifically in Mahogany Hall. So I'm just going to kind of take you through, show you around my dorm room, and then at the end of the video I'm also going to include some clips of the rest of the hall, like the laundry rooms, the trash rooms, the study and social lounges, etc. So yeah, that will be at the end of the video. Alrighty, so this year um, I was in a triple room, so there's supposed to be three different people. There is one bed that's by itself and then two bunk beds. Um, so, but I had the room to myself because of the pandemic and stuff, we weren't allowed to have roommates, but typically this size of a room would have three people living in it. Alrighty, so these are the bunk beds right here. So there's a lower, a bottom bunk, and then an upper bunk. So I just haven't used either of these this year. I just kind of use it like to store extra pillows and stuff. So this is what you normally have if you were going to be in a triple in Tresero. So this is kind of like the wardrobe thing. So it just has like two doors that you can open and then you can kind of like keep your clothes in here. There's like a rod, also has three little drawers as well. So a lot of storage in here. In the dorms that I was living in, they do give you like these little desk hutch things. So it's just like kind of an area for added storage on top of your desk. So this is my desk where I do school and I just have a couple of things up here. And then in the drawers of the desk, I just keep some school supplies, highlighters, notebooks, and then there is some extra space. So some of the drawers in my desk are empty. And then this is just kind of an overview of my desk. I do have a lovely view out my window while I'm studying. And the desk also has two more little drawers. Okay, so in this area of my dorm, this is where my bed is. I took the single bed that wasn't in the bunk bed. So on the bed, I just keep some cute decorative pillows that I color coordinated. And I just have some lights up here that go with the like color theme of my room. And then there also is some extra added storage space under the bed, but I don't really keep anything under here. And so for the dorms that I was in, they do give they gave us like this big pin board. Um, you can like do push pins in. So I just made this collage off of photos I found on Pinterest. And then I just have this goat calendar from Amazon, a little symptom survey reminder from UC Davis, and then a cute poster I got from Target. And then so right here I have like my second desk. So on here I just keep a light that I brought with me, a little dino light and some more pens and stuff for school. So this is just what I keep in the drawers. I don't keep very much in this desk. But yeah, I just kind of like my, it's like my school overflow desk. I don't really use this desk very much, but it is here. So yeah, and then coming over here, I have my microwave and mini fridge. So I did have to bring both of these with me to the dorms. My dorm did not come with these. So I did um, bring these along with me. So I just got this microwave off of Amazon and then I got my fridge, my mini fridge from Best Buy. So I don't keep that much in my fridge, but it is really good for storing a couple snacks or foods for days that are not covered by my meal plan, but I mainly use it to keep my coffee nice and cool. Okay, so moving on, this is my third desk that I have in my dorm room. So this is like where I eat all my food, I guess. Um, the DC this year has been like takeout only. So on top of the desk, I just keep kind of a bunch of random stuff and then one of the lamps that was provided by my dorm. So this is just kind of an overview of the desk. And then in the drawers, I just keep a lot of random stuff. I have this little um, sloth that I got from Home Goods. It's like to hold like hair supplies, I guess. Hair utensils? I don't know what you call those. I have my um, flat iron in there though. This setting for like decoration, it was like an event that we did for our like floor because like the 
CAs and RAs like they have like little events so it was like we made these like little like bead jars I suppose. <laughs> On this desk I also keep my phone soap so this is basically just like a UV like sanitizer thing for my phone so I'll just put it in here like after I go to the DC or I'm out for a while to get my phone all nice and sanitized. So in this part of my dorm room there are there are like two racks on the wall where I keep my towels. And then down by all my towels, I keep a shower caddy. And over here, I have one of my three sets of drawers. I guess it's like a dresser, technically. Um, and then, so this is like, if three people are living in this room, this is like, would technically be somebody's like closet, closet or wardrobe area. And then I have a printer, even though my college does allow us like so many free prints each quarter or year or something, I just have a printer that I got just in case. So there are two shelves up here. And so I am too short to reach the top shelf, but on this one, I just keep um, my toothbrush, some toothpaste, mouth rinse, and then some disinfecting wipes, some hand sanitizer, and then some paper towel and Windex. So this is kind of like my um, cleaning area, I suppose. So this is what that area of the room looks like. Um, so yeah, really a lot of space for storage and keeping things. So yeah, that's this area of my dorm. And then right next to it, there is another like identical little area. Basically the same thing, a bar, two shelves, and another dresser. So in this dresser, I keep a lot of my food and stuff. So in this drawer, I'll keep my food and then I just have like some like extra like paper plates and stuff in this drawer and then in the bottom drawer um, is where I keep all of my like filming equipment and stuff. Um, so yeah, that's where like I keep my tripod and stuff, but this is like a little area that um, if you are coming to Davis and you are gonna be living in a triple could potentially act as like your closet or wardrobe area. So you'll get one of these with three drawers and then a bar and then two shelves. So over here is my door. So I just have like two little command hooks set up here with some masks. And then I also keep my lanyard with my room key hanging up on my door handle. And then I also have this like big mirror right here where I like check my outfits each day. So sorry, the lighting is really bad because my window is open right there, but this is kind of like the full view of my dorm. It is pretty spacious and pretty big. So yes, um, this is this is my dorm. So yeah, one desk right here, bed right here, bunk beds right here, another desk right here, wardrobe right here, and then actually under the bed right here, I do have another dresser, so it is kind of like tucked away under here. So this is kind of like my favorite part of my dorm is like all how all my decorations go together with like my bed and the lights and then kind of like the um, board that I have all my stuff pinned on. So yeah, this is what my, um, that kind of like area of my dorm room looks like. Alrighty, so this is the trash room. I believe that there is one on every floor. So there's compost, trash, and recycling. And then this is the social lounge on the fourth floor of Mahogany Hall. I think every floor has one of these as well. And then this is the laundry and vending machine room. So there's a vending machine and then plenty of washers and dryers that accept credit cards. You do have to bring your own detergent though. And then there also is a little desk where you can do some homework or sit and wait while your clothes are washing. And then this is the area right outside of the dorm building I was living in. And then the front door, which can open automatically once you swipe in. 
Alrighty, so thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment if you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.